Tech Trends 2019, the 10th anniversary, as we look back over 10 years of doing the research, the mission hasn't changed. The technology is changing at a pace and the impact it has the business and how we serve our customers and how work gets done within the organization, even in how products and offerings, how business models are evolving. But we saw as, as we looked at the, over the course of 10 years, what we were focused on, there were some macro themes that started to emerge. And so big topics like cloud and analytics and digital. The last 10 years, those have been in the focus almost every year. And they're universal, but it doesn't mean they're not important. So the novelty might be a little bit off of them, but they're still at the heart of our client strategy. Investments are being driven, trying to figure out the full potential of what they mean. We also see that there's a few trends that get lost and not emphasized enough. Maybe they're not shiny, they don't have the sex appeal of some of the other emerging technologies, but they're fundamental and they're true and they're essential. So things like core modernization, how do we take our existing systems and infrastructure and get it ready to be a foundation for innovation and growth? Risk and cyber, uh, one of the truest things that we continue to have to wrestle with, how do we shift the dialogue from after the fact compliance to a strategic function of shaping what we can and should be doing and pushing against boundaries and conventions. And then the business of IT and the evolution of the technology organization. How do we think about putting together the ability to do more with less certainty in emerging areas with a fierce focus on business impact? So those three were huge and important to the, the cloud analytics digital, kind of looking back the last 10 years, these big macro forces. Uh, and they're just as important going forward. And then the three big areas that we see as the, what will feel like cloud analytics and digital as we look out five years. Blockchain, the foundation for assets and the foundation for thinking about trust in a different way. Cognitive, moving from analytics being a very data focused discussion and insight focused to how do we predict and how do we take action? So machine learning and natural language and AI, how does that feed into automating a response not just looking at and understanding data. And then this idea of digital reality, which is augmented reality and virtual reality and Internet of Things, and now we're moving into new and intelligent interfaces, moving beyond the point and click and type and touch and swipe that we used to have as how we interact with technology into this more natural, much more personal and frankly impactful way, gestures and understanding intent. This year we took a slightly different approach. We said the first chapter of Tech Trends is going to take those macro forces and explain why, looking back the last five years, looking forward the next five years, and those hidden ones that we think are so essential, how they've evolved, how important they are, and probably most importantly, how connected they are. They're not independent, isolated things. They have to come together. The only thing for sure is the pace of change continues to accelerate, and so we better be ready to take full advantage of wherever that change might be coming from. And I think there's enough proof points that that can be done and done well in a deliberate way.